I found another fun little game for you here, guys. This is called Stickman Trenches. You're probably going to need the, need a new 4080 uh, graphics card to run this one. But yeah, yeah, the graphics are garbage, guys. But it's Stickman. It's Stickman Trench Warfare. Who cares? Who cares? Anyway, what you do in this, you, you literally buy troops. You get gold given every few seconds, and you can sit and wait till the gold gets higher and higher and buy better units, or you can just buy the trash mobs and say, Get over the f***ing trench! As your men go over the top and run into a new trench, they will capture it if there's no one else in there, and they will sit and defend that unless you press the icon at the bottom which says, Get over the f***ing top and run to the next trench, and they'll just keep going until you tell them to stop. The enemy will do every exactly the same from the other side of the map. They're charging forward trying to grab trenches. Sooner or later, your forces are going to meet, and that's when you've got to just say, Right, hold the f defense lads will will reinforce you a bit just hold the line and the enemy does the same and then it's a bit of a standoff everybody just looking at each other and wondering whether to go over the top whether you've got enough soldiers you constantly reinforcing all of the time uh, because you're constantly getting gold so you're sending more troops over you do also have to buy and un well unlock units with medals now if you wait long enough you'll get a weapon drop and that can be gold or medals so what I was doing, I was kind of holding back to me on my medals and just sending forward trash mobs, hoping to to hold hold the line until I got three medals, and then I could unleash a bombing run, or I think it's artillery actually. And then once that happens, all fucking hell breaks loose because whoever breaks first, the enemy, if they if we break first, they'll just keep charging all the way to our uh, front lines, and then it's game over if they reach our command center. But we can do the same. So when that happens, it's panic mode. You've got to reinforce a trench way away from them to try and get as many soldiers in so that when they hit you can maybe just run them down and just uh, take them out in no man's land and then restart again if you like now it all sounds really good fun at the minute and i guess it is i mean this game that you're watching now was probably the best game i've had on it but most games the ai just absolutely cheats it'll start with uh, artillery and the artillery that the enemy fires at you is devastating it just shreds your trenches when you fire it back at them Generally speaking, you miss. They cheat like shite. They've got access to all the units from the get-go, generally, when they when they come forward. And it it, it kind of ruined it a lot for me. It, it kind of felt pretty pointless to play if the enemy's going to just cheat like this, which it blatantly does. And also, why can't we retreat? Why can't we retreat back a trench? The, the strategy aspect's ruined by not having much control over your actual troops. It's just go forward or that's it. Go forward or stop. That's that's all you can do, and then and choose what what troops you have. It needs way way more in the in the sort of strategy area where you can withdraw. You can you should be able to issue commands to different units as well because sometimes I don't want everybody piled forward in the first first trench. But the way you do it at the minute, you've just got to select the trench trench behind you and say don't go forward past that. Um, but you are then limited to what you can put in that trench. You can't just say I want my snipers back a trench. Uh, because I do not want my snipers in the, in the in the leading trench. I want to keep my snipers back a bit until they come over the top and then fire from range with my sniper rifles as they're coming over the top. But you can't, which, it, it yeah, it needs way, way more control. But it's still all right. Some games are good, but a lot of them are just slaughters. And it's just, yeah, damn. Anyway, I'll let the rest of this battle play out because it, it is quite good and only lasts another 30 seconds or so. So I'll see you in the next video, guys.